The Word for Today, written by Bob and Debbie Gass. Preparing for Greater Things. To succeed in life, you need thick skin when it comes to handling criticism. It's what separates those who say they want success from those who are prepared to pay for it. For example, if you've been praying for a mate to share your life, Ask yourself if you're prepared for the sacrifice and responsibility that comes with marriage. Are you stable? Are you unselfish? Are you mature enough to provide for a family? Or if you're asking God to increase your business, are you providing outstanding service to your existing clients? Someone quipped, a peacock that rests on its feathers is just another turkey. Sometimes we're in love with the image of success, but we haven't counted the actual cost of succeeding. It's a good thing God doesn't automatically give us everything we ask for. Often we want something because it looks good in someone else's life. But God in his wisdom knows that right now it would hurt us because we're not mature enough to handle it. God tests us with what we have in order to develop our consistency and strength. He observes how we handle the pressures that accompany the blessings he's already given us. He wants to bring us to a place where we're impervious to adversity, where we've learned to appreciate the giver more than his gifts. When we reach that point, we hear him say, you have been faithful with a few things. I will put you in charge of many things. Come and share your master's happiness. Matthew 25, 23. Those words will make everything you've been through worthwhile.